Now, the king is doing well after undergoing a procedure for an enlarged prostate and has spent the night in hospital. Yes, King Charles was spotted entering the London clinic on Friday morning with the Queen at his side, the same hospital where the Princess of Wales is being cared for following abdominal surgery. So who better to join us now and discuss this and all other royal news for the week uh, is our royal correspondent, and of course, my very good friend of the show as well, Jenny Bond, how are you? I'm all right, thanks, Pete. So, it's a lovely day here. The sun is shining on the sea. Love that. Now, also good news is that King Charles is doing well. Is that right? Yeah, we're told he's doing well. Yeah, they, they've been um, very open about things this time, which is most unusual when royals go into hospital. It's usually shrouded in secrecy. God, I remember, you know, when the Queen Mother, for example, was in hospital and had had her hip operation, was very nearly out of the door before we knew anything about it. So this has been very different, very open. And the king has deliberately made his prostate problem public, uh, hoping that other men will go and get checked up. And, you know, the, the figures show, the NHS website shows that there has been a surge in people going. So he had his procedure mm. uh, yesterday. Uh, we're told it went well. Uh, he's been overnight in hospital. He may come out today um, or he may need to stay a little bit longer. It depends um, n not to be indelicate, w whether whether things are working OK right now. Mm, so mm. once things start working, he'll go home. And the Princess of Wales is in the same hospital and she's still in, which I, I, I was a bit surprised at. I mean, how, how is she doing? Well, we're told that she too has had successful abdominal surgery, but this is much more concerning and that it must have been something very serious. I've been quite pleased that we, the media, have been enormously respectful about Catherine's wish to keep this private. Everyone has the right to keep their, their medical history and difficulties private. That's what she asked for, and that is what she's got. People are not camping outside the hospital. We don't know what, what the problem is. We may mm -hmm. never know what the problem is, but she doesn't want us to know that. But um, she's had a visit. I mean, yesterday she, she was visited by the king and Camilla, um, before he went into his operation, which again is really unusual in royal circles and mm. shows you they're just being normal, really. Yeah, I thought that was really heartwarming, actually, that the king, before going in for his own operation, went in to see Catherine, the Princess of Wales. I thought that was a really lovely thing, actually, uh, to see him do. Jenny Bond, really good to see you this morning. Thank you very much. As for your always. Time. As always. Yeah, thanks.